The Gulf African Bank expresses support for interest in capping, or rather interest capping proposed in a bill passed by Parliament to cap interest rates at 4% of the central bank rate. Now, the bank has also partnered with Safaricom to train women entrepreneurs on investment, capacity building, provision of credit facilities and expertise needed to start businesses. Gulf Bank Managing Director Abdallah Abdul Khalik has expressed support for capping of interest rates. There is a concerted effort by the entire uh, banking industry to bring down interest rates. This has initi was initiated by the members of parliament and um, I think uh, they have very, very good reasons for uh, introducing that. Uh, we want to support that bill. Uh, maybe not in the form that it was presented, but in, in a way that uh, will also benefit the Monanchi uh, to enjoy uh, lower interest rates. The managing director said Gulf Bank has already presented a memorandum of understanding to the central bank and is working with other stakeholders on how they will cooperate so that the interest rates are capped at 4% above the benchmark lending rate. We have already uh, given uh, a memorandum of understanding between us and uh, the Central Bank of Kenya and Kenya Bankers Association and the Ministry of Finance how banks will uh, collaborate uh, and cooperate with the members of parliament to make sure that interest rates in this country should come down. The MD who spoke at a training of 350 women entrepreneurs said effective utilization of credit is key to realizing success in investment. Gulf African Bank's role in this is how to enable and create an enabling environment for these women to go into business. Uh, the enabling environment meaning uh, offering them capacity building, uh, offering them uh, credit facilities and offering them expertise that they need to start off these businesses. He said the bank is passionate about empowering women and youth. There is a lot of emphasis, I think, uh, globally on empowering women and youth. Uh, this is an area that uh, Gulf African Bank is very passionate about. Uh, even when we started this bank, we started with that vision that uh, at the time when we started the bank, there were already 40 other banks in the country. So why did we need the 41st or 42nd bank in this country? We said that bank has to come with a value proposition. And that value proposition we brought to the, to, to, to the, to the market is that we want to focus and empower a certain segment of our community. We have started with women. Well, um, women banking program actually has three pillars to empower protect and educate the women. We have financing products for women that caters for the fact that uh, women don't have tangible collateral. And as we all know, statistics shows that only 1% of women in Kenya actually own property. And what this, this product does is actually ensure that women are able to access financing. Statistics by the International Finance Corporation of the World Bank indicate that 39% of formal enterprises are run by women, yet less than 43% have access to financial institutions. Judith Akolo, The Business Defined.